the book of Micah, we have a, well, it's a pretty powerful, also convicting verse that goes like this. He has shown you, O man, what is good, and what does the Lord require of you, but to do justly, to love mercy, and to walk humbly with your God. Let's just start with to do justly. There's a story told of a man who lived in a village with a group of people, and he was well known as a woodcutter, a guy who cut firewood for the people. And a rumor started circulating around the village that he, well, that he got saved, that his life did change. And everybody thought, no way, not this guy. We know him. He's kind of beyond being reached. And they were all gathered in this little grocery store discussing him, and one guy slipped out. And he went to the woodcutter's business, and he measured the wood, and it was exactly four foot long. Well, this man was known for cutting the wood short. The requirement was four feet for firewood, but he always cheated everybody. So he ran back to the grocery store and he said, hey, it's true, it's true. They said, well, how do you know it's true? He said, I measured his wood and it's four feet long. It's never been that before. He was doing justly. One of the results or consequences of becoming a true believer is that you do things justly. That's what Micah said. Do justly, walk humbly before the Lord. There's evidence of your faith and it can be seen in the way you do things justly. Mm -hmm.